Black people are really dangerous, chaotic, thuggish, and they're all ugly. I'm white. I would like to clarify the fact that I am delusional. I can't relate. My nose, my lips, my ears, they're really giant. No, I'm actually some type of retarded. Kim Kardashian, think in a criminal way. You might be lying. I don't trust anything that anyone else says. I know that I'm delusional. Well, ugly. Irritated. Ignorant. Completely wrong. I know who I am, and I'm some type of retarded. Negro. There's no doubt in my mind. Hi there, welcome to Richard's Report. I'm Richard, obviously. The black race has gone through a lot of very embarrassing situations lately that are still fresh in people's mind. Bill Cosby, R. Kelly, and of course, Yeshua, the Christ. <laughs> and to ensure that these situations stop, I want to speak directly to these men, Bill. Don't assault women, okay? In fact, don't touch women. If you need to reproduce, just masturbate into a cup and have a doctor implanted. <laughs> As for the rest of your sex life, might I suggest you enlist the aid of a flesh flight? <laughs> Remember, your skin is way too dark to be mistaken for white. You can't always pay them $130,000 like you're some kind of Donald Trump. <laughs> and persons who won't overlook it and say it was 30 years ago, let it go, you're not Brett Kavanaugh. <laughs> or Kelly, everyone was with you when you made them believe they could fly. <laughs> but if you piss on someone, they will remove you from their playlist. I remember I myself have pissed on someone. Lots of times. With that person usually being me. I didn't mean to do it. It's just that sometimes when you, you want a piss to go straight and it end up on your leg instead. So I can see our situation might be a bit different. As a baby, my brothers used to piss on me when I changed their diaper. I really don't know how to help you, but at least you're not in prison. And the man you guys know as Jesus, well, is very suspicious the way he is presented. Black man going around everywhere with 12 other black men. I find that suspicious, and I am black. I would have to find out which one of these men, as a sick grandma, I could use to turn him. As it turned out, it only took 30 pieces of silver. <laughs> and even that made things more suspicious. He betrayed him with a kiss. How embarrassing. <laughs> and I hear all you persons shouting that Jesus was white. Primarily because of all those white pictures of Jesus you have been exposed to. But trust me, he was a black man. Go ahead, look at the character description or don't because i have documented proof 150 year old painting blessed by pope leo the 13th this is the true face of jesus christ one of a handful of paintings based on the cloth used to wipe jesus's face before his crucifixion known as the veil of veronica so why am i dragging my own race through the mud well i went online and things aren't looking good I know a lot of people take issue with my beliefs. I'm white. I think there is something wrong with my screen. Bob Buckler, don't stop it. Don't yeah, man. Couple of did a yeah, doctor start. Because this girl clearly looks black. This black looking girl is actually white? I'm a Caucasian because everything about me is different from an African American. I have naturally straight hair. My hair isn't nappy, it doesn't require weave. My nose is not giant, it's like African Americans. My lips are perfect, they're not too big and they're not too small, like, they're just perfect. What are you talking about? Your lips makes you uniquely qualified to be a circuitry. 
So I just want to write a text that may not be used for any commercial purposes without express written permission. Because I'm white. My figure is just like Kim Kardashian, and she's a wonderful role model. <laughs> Kim Kardashian, a role model? She's oddly a role model for mannequins, and they have no pride. They can often be seen in store naked, posing for everyone to see. <laughs> Kim Kardashian is basically an overpaid prostitute, who along with her husband like wearing MAGA hats. <laughs> and just so we're clear, Kim is, and I know this will shock you, black. Oh, hold on, let me just, let me just look at what Wikipedia says. According to Wikipedia, her mother is of Dutch, English, Irish, and Scottish ancestry, while her father is a third generation Armenian American. Sounds pretty white to me. So, you know, I guess she's white. Sorry, I made that mistake. I just couldn't tell by looking because she bought herself that fake ass. And you know, she didn't have an accident like Nicki Minaj. That's embarrassing with your fake ass literally, literally hanging out. White people act and think just way more mature than African Americans. Acting and thinking you are something doesn't make you that thing. For example, I think I'm funny, but that doesn't make it so. In fact, probably I am the person watching this video. White people act and think just way more mature than African Americans. Black people, they think in a criminal way. What is wrong with them? They're really dangerous, chaotic, thuggish, and they're all ugly. Wow. She sounds like she's reading directly from the Wikipedia page for black people. Of course, that's Wikipedia with three Ks. <laughs> Another thing, white people act more mature. Maturity is not genetic. It's not sickle cell. I can think of a white person who goes around making fun of people. I had one beer, right? I had one beer. Well, do you think it was, nope, it was one beer. Oh, good. How did you get home? I don't remember. How'd you get there? I don't remember. Where is the place? I don't remember. How many years ago was it? I don't know. I don't know. He really shouldn't be doing, thing, um, be doing that when he can't pronounce anonymous. The latest act of resistance is the op-ed published in the failing New York Times by an anonymous, really an anonymous, gutless, Howard. And here's another one who sent an entire internet to flood the FCC's website. This is the moment you were made for, commenters. Like Ralph, Ralph Macchio, you've been honing your skills, waxing cars and painting fences. Well, guess what? Now it's time to do some fucking karate. Ron Paul fan 2016. One Direction forever. One Direction sucks balls. We need you to get out there and for once in your lives, focus your indiscriminate rage in a useful direction. Seize your moments, my lovely trolls. Turn on Caps Rock and fly, my pretties. Why am I bothering John Oliver? It's, it has nothing to do with the fact that this is his photo on, it, on his Wikipedia page. What, what do you call that face? It looks like the mandatory smile of a person who is constipated. <laughs> it looks like a guy who farted and is trying desperately not to laugh. <laughs> nope, it's because I needed him for the joke. Are you okay? I'm irritated. I'm sorry. I just know that I'm white. I mean, she might not know that I'm white, but I know that I'm white. I can feel it through my veins. I feel it through my blood. Are you sure that's not cholesterol? cocaine or epinephrine you're on something she did say we're on two different levels like okay african americans are here i'm here <laughs> this girl is clearly higher than the empire state building <laughs> and how can you know more about how you came into existence than the person who caused you to come into existence <laughs> that's, that's like like me looking at yahweh and saying, 
No way you created me from mud. My ancestors are apes and the reason I'm so ugly is because I share 90% of my DNA with a monkey. I tell my mom I'll never be like any of those Negroes. I guess she'll be a new kind of Negro. My mom tries to criticize me about my supposed race. I tell her she's just ignorant. There's nothing wrong with my views or beliefs because I have freedom of speech and everything I'm saying is true. What a dangerous combination. No sense, a mouth, and freedom of speech. A wise man said many times, many, many times, it is better to be silent and to be thought a fool than to open your mouth and remove all doubt. She has clearly chosen the latter part. Thank God for freedom of speech because if not for that, no one would have to deal with whatever crap this is. Although they would not have to deal with any of this either. What's the favorite thing you have in common with your father? Real estate, golf. Well, sex. If Ivanka weren't my daughter, I'd be dating her. You know? <laughs> it's nice to see a father kiss his daughter. And Trump responded, I kiss her as often as I can. Why would anybody think they should cut that out? <laughs> <laughs> it's just a proud father who wants to get after his daughter. Vegas in another flop. But is he on the right side this time? Yo, you are an idiot, you know. Look at me and tell you cool. Me tell you look for me, me show you set. My, me show you see a Vegas attack. You still go kill the man, my youth. Like you are an idiot, my youth. Hey, man, I'm on your prayer. Like, I'm a kid. Oh, you're gone. You're gone. So you kill the youth. So you kill the youth. You kill the man. You see it? You kill him. Remember me say the blogger boy. Or the blogger girl. Suck your man. And the screamer record my life. And put you out. And put no bad remarks. Because so does the Mitch McConnell has created millions of jobs for China. <laughs> Unless it's a carton box of apologies, which licking a face dog, me can come on your next show in a Kingston with my entourage and me will approach you and your entourage and tell you, me see how the box in a face can go. Don't fuck yourself, dog. And I want regular citizens of Jamaica this year to talk to. No, bro. Bro. <laughs> We will bring nightmares to your doorsteps. We will make you have to turn up your security. We will make you can't trust no car and bike or drive or ride past you. I mean, say man, wicked. Believe that. We are on Kingston, Jamaica. Yeah. I'm white. This is our most important midterm election, perhaps ever. Democracy is dead. If a roof is not egg on a roof, which way the egg of a roll go? No, I have a roll to the hen and jump down. Yes, in the lower part. But if you don't have the higher part, you have to roll and go down and jump and play. So we roll along the car up on the roof and to roll along to the. to the gong, the flatter side. We're not playing games and. <laughs> That's very nice, thank you. That's very nice. No bell. <laughs> Little knives, knives, knives. When you hear about slavery for 400 years, for 400 years, that sounds like a choice. <laughs> like, you was there for 400 years and it's all of y'all? You know, like, it's like we're, we're mentally in prison. I like the word prison because slavery goes di too, too direct to the uh, idea of blacks. It's like slavery, Holocaust, Holocaust Jews, uh, slavery is blacks. The latest act of resistance is the op-ed published in the failing New York Times by an anomalous, really an anomalous, gutless coward. My friend, my friend Jim told me immigrants are climbing. They're climbing into Paris, trying to, they're trying to pull. The police are trying to pull them out, but they can't. And that's why, you know, they need, you know, they need a wall. They are about to strip people. so-called Christian looking whores yes, jumping in some church flapping your ankle chains around all on the choir breasts hanging out lips all red nails painted red purple blue green long like bird claws all this fake hair breast skin plaid toenails painted with little fake diamonds in it your hey. toes ain't richer you're nothing but a prostitute this just goes to show you opinions are a bit like assholes everybody's got one and they all stink. <laughs> I'm Richard. See you in the next one.